Alright. Ready to get the fuck out of the house, man. I'm getting death threats. Yeah, I got it close. What the fuck, though? Now nah, I just gotta run up and get a box of beer and some smoky oakies. And Garmin Verbetted has come out with uh, an update to the software. So for the uh, for the video editing software. So I want to see how it does. Supposed to have a high of 36 today and snow either tomorrow night or Monday. So that's really friggin' good news. We got a week of uh, cold temps and then we'll be back up into the 50s and 60s again. So, as you can tell, I'm not really pushing a whole lot. Not a whole lot going on. Just another day in the neighborhood. So we're going to talk about the Verb Elite. We're going to talk about the Garmin Verb camera. And I have to say, at this point, I would not recommend it. I would recommend the Verb Edit software, which you can download for free, but really can't do a whole lot with it unless you have the uh, Verb or the Verb Elite camera. But like I'm saying, I would not recommend the Garmin Verb or Verb Elite camera because they can't seem to get the firmware set up. Go ahead, yo. Are you fucking serious? You're looking at me like I'm going to run the stop sign? Yeah, you just wanted to look at me because I'm so cool in my gear, yo. But overall, I'm... I'm, I'm I'm uh, happy and disappointed in the Verb because I really expected it to be a lot better than what I'm getting right now. And if they can't seem to get the firmware to write the temperature gauge to the friggin' uh, to the GPX files and the FIT files. That's uh, that's a bad thing. Because I think they should have had that fixed or working before they even sold the goddamn thing. I mean, I can... That's one of the other things we're going to test today is I want to see the delay in the speed and shit like that. Because so far they haven't been able to fix it. Now that's a question of is it firmware or software? I don't friggin' know. 
And what we're going to do is we're going to do two videos here. Because supposedly they fixed some shit, so we'll let you know. Match up. The other question is, is are the speeds and all that bullshit going to be spot on? Well, we've hit the high. It's 36 here. Look how fast his uh, blinker's flashing. Guess that means he's got a rear one out. And he's blowing oil. Yeah, it's not flashing. Yeah, I, I really like I really like the Garmin camera. I like how it's set up. I like everything about it. But I'm a bit pissed off with the firmware, guys. Because A, they don't communicate. And B, they're taking forever to get some issues solved. And I don't know if you guys are watching Brad Herter's uh, videos with his Garmin. His camera is still locking up. So he shot a video of it. Well, he got a hold of me and I said, shoot a video of it and send it to him. So he did that. And you know what these dumb fuck answered him with was, oh, well, we solved that in 3.1. And I'm just like, well, obviously not, because this is still doing it, and he has 3.2 on there. Which I've said for a long time, 3.2 firmware is a fucking piece of shit, too. And since they don't communicate, who knows when the next one's coming out. I think we went two months the last time before they came out with 3.2. And so now I'm waiting for, I don't know, 3.3 that's supposed to fix my uh, temp gauge, my temp sensor. But Brad Herders, his uh, his um, oh, what do you call it? He's got the heart monitor and he's got the cadence sensor, and that shit's not working for him. Hey, it works off and on. So, I watched his video this morning, and then I set it, sent it off to Man's Wish, and said, see what you think about this. And so, Man's Wish questioned what card he's got in there, is his computer updated, all very strong, valid points. 
And so I fired him off. I, I fired Brad off question about that shit. And I think Brad uses a, um, I think he uses a Mac. But basically, I'm getting tired of dealing with um, excuses. Um, just basically in general. It's not doing what it's supposed to do. And But I have patience, but you're really pushing my patience to the end, Garmin. And if this comes out like shit, I'll be in your ass too. Now, if you want to make me happy and be a bit more patient, put a firmware site up on the forums where we can ask questions and get friggin' answers. Which I've asked you, I don't know, nine or ten times now to include that onto the forum site. But, yeah, I know. Forum, uh... Firmware guys are notoriously um, all about X's and O's and numbers and ones and zeros. So you can't seem to figure it out. So, all right, later.